guys welcome to my channel dash of home and today's video i'm going to be showing you guys all the items i got for my kids easter basket i have three kids i have a nine-year-old daughter a seven-year-old daughter and a three-year-old son so we get a couple different age ranges I have a little boy and older girls and so you're gonna see all the items that I picked from them both of my girls are completely different and so I have tons of different items that I got from Target Amazon and there are a couple other items that I got at some random stores that I will mention as well all right, so first, this year I did get my kids new Easter baskets. I don't get them new baskets every year, but their baskets last year were just um, some plastic ones that I had like stickers with their names on. And so this year I wanted to get them some like more durable, sturdy baskets. And so these are the baskets. All of these baskets are from Target. And I think they're like neutral, cute enough that my daughters um, and son might just use them after Easter as well. And so this one is for my middle daughter, Mila, who is seven. It is like a cream colored woven basket with rainbow handles. She loves everything bright and pink and rainbows and butterflies. So I thought she would love this and I know she'll use this in her room after Easter as well. The next one, this is for my three year old. And so it's like a little dinosaur. It's that same woven material, has a little handle on top, a little cute tail. And so I could see my son using this as well. He loves like carrying toys. He has tons and tons and tons of like Hot Wheel cars. Now he'll just kind of stack this up <laughs> and take those with him places. So that is for my son Nico, who's three. And then this one is um, for my oldest daughter, Emma, who is nine, but she thinks she is much older than that. Um, she is extremely mature and this basket just suits her. Um, and so I know that she will love putting this in her room afterwards and she will uh, actually use it. So those are the three baskets. All of those baskets are for Target. I will try to link everything down below in the description, but if I miss something, just leave me a comment and I will be sure to get it up. I'm gonna share the couple things that I got at other stores and then we'll move on to the larger Target and Amazon hauls. I tend to shop online, like a lot of the online boutiques um, that do like lives on Facebook or if you have their app, you can get stuff. And so they had some candy club candies. Um, so I got one for each of my kids. I got these strawberry like marshmallow puffs for my middle daughter. These starfish sweeties. So they're like little starfish tropical gummies. I got those for my son. He really likes gummies. He does not like chocolate um, or really too many sweets. And so gummies are really the only thing that he likes. And then I got these pink lemonade sour belts for my oldest daughter she loves gummies and sour um she's not supposed to have a lot of it because of her braces but it's easter so why not this item i got from kohl's um this is for my oldest daughter and it's just a t-shirt that says savage um that sums up her attitude <laughs> um nicely but i did like it because there's like little pink flowers i don't know if she'll um, like those flowers as much as I do but I thought it was a cute shirt for her. How I like to fill our Easter baskets is instead of using like that crinkly paper or that plastic grass um, I like to stuff the bottoms with like little t-shirts little shorts um, because where we live around Easter is when um, it starts warming up and so we need new t-shirts new shorts um, sometimes I do bathing suits it kind of just depends um, this year I needed to buy some suits early because my kids are doing like swim at our local YMCA decided to get them some t-shirts and shorts um, to stuff that in their baskets this year Okay. All right, moving on, we will do my Target haul first. So all of these items were from Target. I did buy them all online. I love online shopping. Um, so if I can get stuff online, that's normally what I tend to do. So a little bit more clothes. This is for my middle daughter. It's just a cute like little butterfly shirt from Target. It almost matches her basket, which is super cute. I got her this like peace flowery shirt as well. 
And then I got her these like light blue shorts. They do go with like these flowers. And so I thought that was like a super cute homeschool play day outfit um, that will be super comfy for her as well. I got my son these little rubber flip flops. And so um, I think these will be good. I really don't like flip flops and sandals for little kids, but these ones, they have like enough straps that you can tighten around their feet. And so I figured these will be good around our pool outside because the ground gets super hot. My middle daughter, uh, Mila, I got these mini brands Disney. She loves mini brands, all the different varieties. Um, she hasn't even mentioned the Disney version to me yet. I saw them on YouTube and I was like, oh, I might know something before her. So. Hopefully these are like a huge surprise to her and I can't wait to see inside those. I got this Count on the Easter Pups. It's a Paw Patrol book for my son, a little board book about Easter. And so I thought that that would be super cute for him. These shorts are for my older daughter. Um, she doesn't like a lot of colors, so I got her black and gray. Uh, nothing crazy, but just comfy shorts for her to be able to throw on. I got her this shirt as well. I can't even, and it's Snow White, like, fainting, which is totally my older daughter's attitude. Um, she actually had this shirt a couple years ago, um, but she got too small for her, and so I got it in her size now a little bit bigger, and so I think she'll really like that, because she loved that shirt. She thought it was hilarious. I got these Hot Wheel color reveal. So I've seen the color reveal for... Um, Barbies where you like dunk the Barbie in water and they change colors but these are Hot Wheel cars my son is obsessed with cars but he has so many and so whenever I buy Hot Wheel packs I'm just like I feel like he already has these even though he probably doesn't but um, I just I don't like buying them because we have hundreds of Hot Wheel cars so this I thought would be fun um, you're probably not supposed to put it in the bath but I'll probably let him bring them in the bath and then it will be like a little cool um, reveal for him. So I got those for him. Um, some necklaces for my daughter. So this one is for my middle daughter, Mila. It's like an M. It's two chains and the other one has like just like little rhinestones on it. So that is for her. And then I didn't realize these were best friend necklaces, um, which I actually think is cute now. And these are for my older daughter. It's just a silver star and moon. My daughter is very simple, but she likes wearing necklaces, and so I, her and I share a lot of necklaces, so because there's two, I'm hoping that maybe she'll want to share with me. We'll see. Maybe even her sister. I highly doubt she'll want to share with her sister. She'd probably want to share with me before her sister. Um, I got a pack of bubbles. Um, like I said, Easter stuff is normally like spring, summer, gear up, so I always tend to get like bubbles and stuff, so... These are six bubbles. Each kid will get two packs of bubbles in their basket. I got this little Harry Potter um, character. My three-year-old son is obsessed with Harry Potter. Like, I don't know what happened, but we have been watching all of Potter movies nonstop straight for like the past two weeks. Um, he just really likes Harry Potter. We all like Harry Potter too, but he's like obsessed. So I thought it'd be cute to get him some cute little toys. Um, this is one I could find online. I'll probably start picking some up um, as I'm out at stores for Christmas and things like that. I got these little peeps, like they're on a stick. They're like lollipop sticks, but they're just normal peeps. Um, my daughters like these gross marshmallow things. And so, um, these always look cute in their baskets, so they will get those. I also found these little bags of bunny bait. It's like trail mix. It's peanuts, pretzel or white chocolate pretzel balls, uh, milk chocolate candies, confetti cookie pieces, white chocolate raisins, marshmallows, and M&M's um, pastel candy. So I was thinking that I could probably stuff these in eggs for them to find or I'll just throw them in their bag. So that will kind of depend if they can fit in the eggs or not. Um, because my son did not get one of these, I got him a bag of gummy peeps. Um, like I said, I don't think he would like the texture of a real peep, but I know he likes gummies and so I got these for him. 
And then I got Reese's peanut butter eggs and Lifesavers Olipops for, um, again, just like egg stuffers if I need them or I'll just fill them in the basket. Or even we always have a big family event on Easter at our house. So if we just need, you know, extra bowls of candy or whatever. Last item was just food coloring. Um, I need that for some of the stuff we do around Easter and for like Easter um, day. And so I just wanted to pick that up. And then I also got Almond Joy eggs. Both of my daughters absolutely love these. So these, um, again, will either be like an egg stuffer or something else in their basket. All right, so moving on. So that was everything from Target. I did all of that in like a Target online order some stuff ships some stuff i went and picked up at the store um and i did it over like two different orders so i will try to link as much as i can below but if i forget anything just make sure you leave a comment uh down below oh i did forget something oh i forgot two more things sorry <laughs> two more target things um these are another pair of shorts for my middle daughter they're just like a more of a green blue color to match one of her other t-shirts and then i did get my son a little t-shirt um, I bought him a bunch of t-shirts and shorts last year that he never grew into and so they're going to actually fit him this year and so that's why he only got one t-shirt but then he got the sandal so that will be at the bottom of his basket as like the stuffing okay all right now on to Amazon so Amazon I just got some more like fun stuff um, I made my daughter's custom planners for the rest of the school year and so I got this pen pack for my oldest daughter they're just a bunch of different color um, pens that were like recommended in like the planner section. Um, and so I, those are for my older daughter and they're black. So she'll love them like <laughs> the black coloring on the outside. I got these ones for my middle daughter. So they are obviously a lot cuter, <laughs> more colorful. And so those are for her. I got some highlighters for them. Um, I figured they're going to probably want to highlight stuff in their planners like Marka has done. Um, and so I'm probably going to split this pack between them. So these are like super babyish. Um, they even say like four months and up. They are like little rattle balls, but they're floating balls. And so my son um, loves bath toys, loves pool toys, but all of the pool type toys that you can find, they're all... Um, like for diving and so they always sink and so I figured that these would be fun in the pool um, that they would actually float so he could actually you know swim to get them he wouldn't have to ask me or his sisters to dive down and get them out of the pool so um, I will take them out of the packaging so he doesn't feel baby ish uh, but I thought that those would be fun because they float um, I got my older daughter this like ombre gray water bottle and it also has like what times you're supposed to drink it by and like um for morning and night how many ounces and so she does a lot of like sports uh she's on swim team right now and so she needs like a good water bottle that she can fill up and just go um has a good lid and i hope it doesn't leak so that is for her i also got my older daughter these colored pencils and they're scented color pencils and they're already all sharpened I don't even know why I'm smelling. I'm getting over a cold and I can't smell anything. Yeah, I can't smell anything. Maybe I'm just making up. No, they are scented. Yeah, I really can't smell anything. Um, so those are for her. I thought that that would be cute. She loves drawing and art and she really likes colored pencils. Um, this is a, um, like a merch from another YouTuber. Um, <laughs> lanky box if any of your kids watch them my middle daughter is obsessed with them and so I found like I don't even really know I didn't realize they had characters I guess but they do and so I think this is boxy and so she's gonna freak out um with this so I got her that um as I'm looking at putting everything down on their baskets I don't know how everything's gonna fit because the baskets are I mean they're not huge so this is gonna be fun filling them um, this bag, these are like splash balls, so you get them wet and you can like launch them at each other. They're like, almost like a water balloon, but like that you can keep reusing them. So I got a whole bag of them from Amazon. Um, I know my kids will love these in our pool, and I was also thinking our dog, um, we didn't have him last summer, as well as our pool wasn't really ready last summer. Um, and so 
I just know he's gonna be a water dog and so he's gonna freak out being able to like chase these and then I believe they float on top of the water as well so we don't have to worry about them going to the bottom of the pool so I'll probably place a couple of those in each of their baskets and then I got um, just like bubbles I always get them chalk because it's a springy outdoor type thing and so I got I got I got glitter chalk and neon chalk I think I also I also ordered one more I know for sure because I have three kids um, I want to say it was tie-dye but it's just something happened with the shipping and so I don't think I'm gonna get that one to this week but you guys get the gist it's another package of chalk I will link the tie-dye one down below and so I'll split those up amongst my kids and then that is it as far as like what I'm stuffing in Easter baskets um, obviously we've had kids for a while so we have a collection of plastic eggs um, I do this to myself every Easter I sit on the floor the night before and I stuff hundreds of eggs um, this year I'm like I don't want to be stuffing that many eggs so I did buy a couple packs of pre-stuffed eggs from Amazon these ones which they're kind of already broken apart so i'm gonna have to fix some of these but they have cars inside each one and so if you can see so these all of these eggs um have cars in them and i want to say there's 12 eggs so 12 eggs with little cars in them so obviously those will be for my son um at, when he goes and tries to find eggs and then this pack, I, mean, I don't even remember what I ordered. Uh, as you can see, it's like a big box of Easter eggs, but they're pre-stuffed eggs. And so it is a bunch of eggs. Let's see, and I'll try to remember what it is. Oh, they're stuffed with, um, like they're like little squishy, they're called mochis. Um, it's it's kind of clear, so it's gonna be hard to see, but they're just like little animals that are like squishy. Um, all of my kids love these freaking things. I bought a tub of them for one of my daughter's birthdays as like party favors and they all just love them. I think they're so gross because the second they get out of their packaging, they get disgusting. They get like hair all over them and then my daughters try to wash them and it almost like makes it worse. So, uh, <laughs> whatever, but I bought them. So this whole box is full of those eggs with the mochis already in them. So that is probably like 36 eggs already stuffed with like toys and so probably all that i'll have to do is maybe stuff like another like i don't know 20 to 50 just depending um with like some of the candies and stuff that i got the bigger eggs and so i'll see if i can get like some of you know these things in there i really doubt lollipops are gonna fit because they have the long stick but we'll see whatever i can stuff the eggs with so that is everything that I got um, for stuffing the Easter baskets. I'm going to fill the baskets now and then I will show you the final results. baskets are finished and stuffed uh, there was a couple leftover splash balls that didn't fit but um, that is fine I will throw them in our pool 
drawer because I'm sure uh, between the dog and the kids we will go through these pretty fast. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you need anything or if you have any questions make sure you leave it down in the comments. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and as always make sure that you hit that subscribe so you're the first to know when I have a new video. Thanks guys! Bye!